Mine's rolling. How am I doing? Alright. Um, personality workshop, scene two, shot one, take one. And just lower it. And, but, yep, B, uh, A camera mark. And I'm second is Dick's Grace. That's right, and B camera. Camera set. Yep. Set. Action. Charles, please take a seat. I'll be with you in just a moment. Charles, how are you going? It's been about a month since I've seen you. Um, I think the last thing we talked. Oh, yeah, actually, um, I asked you about the personality workshop. Did you um, did you did you take that? Yeah, I've, I've uh, gone once a month since our last appointment. Once, once, sorry, once a week. I do apologise. Okay. Yeah. Once a week since our last appointment. So there's four times. Yeah, four times. That's a okay. Tell me a little bit, how, how did you find it? Uh, well, it was different. It was definitely different. Um, as, as you know from our previous encounters, uh, I used to be a very negative person. Um, now, you know, when something goes bad or, or wrong, uh, I, try, I try and find the positive in it. I look for, I look for the good. You know, an, an example is uh, uh, when, when a good friend that I thought I had betrays me or, or I'm hurt or something. You know, by somebody else. I, I try and look for good things in that. You know, a um, good example of that would be uh, when I'm walking down a one-way street and you've got those stupid cyclists coming the other direction. And of course, I hadn't looked up at the, at the right time to see this guy bearing down upon me with the intent of of maiming me or hurting me or killing me or I don't know whatever it is you know that they want to do. You know, and it it just it really gets to me. But then I think in that situation, you know, the, the glass is either half full or it's half empty. Like, you know, hang on a second. No, sorry, no, 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 sorry. I got that the wrong way around. The glass is either half empty or it's half full. You know. But of course, if, if one of those idiots hits you, your glass is not going to be half full, it's not going to be half empty. It's going to be smashed all over the ground. Its contents are going to be on the ground with it. You know. And at that point, I have to tell myself, it's, it's not all that bad. I have to think to myself, yes, I have this problem, but I have a means of doing things. I'm, I'm, not, I'm not a homeless, starving child in, in Africa or India or China. You know, I, I can do things about this. You know, in the, in the workshop, they suggested, they suggested doing something that I may enjoy, uh, catching a sunrise or a sunset. You know, I've never done those things before, so I've got no idea. One guy suggested me going for a walk in the rain, and I'm like, a, a walk in the rain? I mean, it's raining, it's windy, it's cold, you know, I, mean, I, I, could, I could get pneumonia. I could get violently ill, I could die, I don't, I don't want to die, you know. I mean, I don't know, I, I, still, I still think I need work though, because as you can see, I can still get quite, quite agitated with it all. I'm not, I'm not so sure about this positive thinking BS yet, I don't think it's me. <laughs>